Hey everyone, let's dive deep into a topic that's got everyone talking. Is Canadian Prime Minister Justin Trudeau pushing us towards nuclear war? Trudeau's stance on Ukraine has been controversial, to say the least. First off, Trudeau has pledged over $8 billion in financial and military support to Ukraine since 2022. He made this announcement at the NATO summit, drawing both praise and heavy criticism. Critics argue Trudeau is more focused on foreign affairs than the pressing issues within Canada. Rising living costs, inadequate social safety nets, the list goes on. Many Canadians feel he's out of touch with their struggles. But Trudeau's government insists that supporting Ukraine is vital. They believe it's crucial for defending democracy and deterring future aggression from nations like Russia. On the other hand, critics question the wisdom of escalating Canada's involvement in this conflict. Could this provoke wider global consequences? Now let's talk about Putin. The Russian president has issued stern warnings. He claims that providing long-range weapons to Ukraine would be seen as a direct attack on Russia by NATO. Despite these warnings, Trudeau stands firm, supporting Ukraine's right to defend itself, even if it means targeting Russian military infrastructure. The U.S. also plays a significant role here. While they haven't granted Ukraine's request for long-range missiles, the discussions are ongoing. President Biden has acknowledged these talks. Though the U.S. stance on providing such weapons remains unchanged, they've already approved the use of American weapons for strikes within Russia, albeit near the border. This escalating tension is a ticking time bomb. Ukrainian forces recently crossed the Russian border seizing territory for the first time since World War II. Putin's narrative portrays NATO's involvement as a direct threat to Russia. Are we on the brink of a larger conflict? Let's consider the potential consequences. Provoking a nuclear-armed Russia could lead to catastrophic outcomes, not just for Canada but for the entire world. Some suggest Trudeau's actions are motivated by personal ambition rather than genuine concern for global security. So what do you think? Are Trudeau's actions justified? Do they align with Canada's national interests? It's time to reflect on the potential risks and benefits of Canada's increasing military commitments abroad, especially when we have our own domestic challenges to address. Share your thoughts in the comments below. Let's get the conversation started and don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more deep dives into current issues. Stay informed and stay safe. Thanks for watching.